Hey everyone, Cosmos here from Doll Games. In this video, we're going to be focusing on the end of the self upgrade cycle, and I'm going to be refining my Loki to Odin in this video. And we're gonna talk a little bit about that. So let's jump into it. So, this is the third day on this server, on, on this time zone. Um, the account from which I reported news the, um, there, I already did the Odin, I posted a short video. On, um, on on the Facebook page of Dolly Games Fortune, and uh, now it's Cosmos's turn, um, which is my main account, of course, and so I'm looking forward very much um, to doing it. So here I, I did um, so far just the mount training, which is the last before it expires, and the um, of course the little things like the harvest and stuff, a little bit of mount refining, just 200. I usually do 100, sometimes I, I go to 200, those are the more efficient levels, 100 and 200. I almost never do the, the top levels. And uh, honor, and I have not done the self upgrade and enchant events and also not the advanced enchant because I wanted to do it on the Odin um, if necessary. I'm not 100% sure if he will need. Uh, but if you will need, I'd, I'd prefer to put uh, the sepulchrums into him. So um, I just wanted to show you that still three um, events to do, which give um, which give good amounts of event chests. Here is the upgrade, and there is the enchant. And the advanced one should be somewhere here, self enchant advanced. So still these three not done. If we look at the exchange so that we can see the number of my chests, I have 621 chests though with those events not done yet and after exchanging already for the resources that I need, um, which was I needed to do 22 exchanges on the moon dust and 23 exchanges on the moon rock so this i've already done and i still have 621 chests so with good planning um i know that guildies as well in, in so players in my guild and also players in my server and, and other players who we, we talked with each other by emails or messages or by facebook um it is possible to get a, a above a thousand chests uh, with, with even decent planning and um, you don't even need very high BR to do that just just planning um, even uh, weaker accounts like several million BR can do it so it's not that difficult uh, you just need to plan for it so that you can do all the events of this event cycle fully so if we look at my selves in the refine for the Loki, you can see I already have the 5,000 required moon dust and the moon rocks and the emblems. The emblems are by far the most expensive ones. Um, so, because there are 100 chests for 100 emblems, it's quite expensive. But um, for now, I have the resources and I still have the chests. And, and so, some of you might ask, uh, what am I gonna do with the chests? Am I gonna use them on the regular um, Lucky um, exchange? Uh, for the clothing charts for example and that is definitely an option um, because that will give you more clothing charts more clothing items to engulf and the clothing charts will get you the sets but um, I have a, a longer term goal of having at least three Odins and, and this will be my first one so um, I'm actually uh, considering or probably I will do that, I just need to think about it for one more moment uh, in, in a peaceful time, um, that I will exchange for more of those silk resources, simply. And um, it'll be uh, probably a, a balance, but more towards the light and dark emblem, because there is nowhere in the game to earn these. Um, we get sometimes 10 or so uh, in various um, online rewards like the online gift packs after certain uh, hours but that's too, too small um, it does add up a little bit over time but you need larger amounts so I will consider getting a bunch of uh, light and dark uh, light and dark emblems 
and um, a little bit of moon dust and moon rocks but I will try to get these also via the magic in so that's what I will plan to do with my chest so just getting one um, if you th if you think if you get one you think it's it's good no it's not it's not enough for time portal you'll need three and um, specifically Odin's because um, Thor he will not heal and Frigga doesn't have enough damage output and so it really has to be an Odin and uh, there are three slots so you will need three of them which is uh, not easy for free players, um, non cashers, light cashers and even sometimes medium cashers um, but otherwise um, that's something you first need to I would suggest of course you can do whatever you want but I would suggest uh, you have that as a target so with all that explained let's go into also the skills here because some people ask me what happens to the skills and so forth so that's why I open the skills tab I have basically the healing um, the damage reduction at the moment I have the devour soul attack and heal and I have two Delphix, um, which, which is yeah, which are the, the standard, let's say, Darks Delphic and the uh, merged Apocalypse Delphic. And in the passives, I have a damage decrease 20%, damage increase by 15, and uh, damage decrease by 20. So 20, 20, 15, two Delphix, a healing uh, attack, healing 75%. And uh, damage reduction so let's go refine now Loki got the resources got the gold got the emblems yes and there we go there is the Odin so first let's pop into the skills and let's go also bring him up where is it pin to bring him up to the top Let's look at the skills. There is the healing attack, there is the 75% healing, the damage reduction, the two Delphix, and there are the exact same passives. So nothing happens to your skills. You just get them. Uh, you just upgrade yourself. So with the Odin now, um, there is uh, the upgrade because he is orange. So that's gonna take a while because I semi stupidly. Um, put the, my advanced Mara into Venus here and the reason I say semi stupidly is because it's not actually a waste <coughs> it, it is because on the on the second path I'm developing um, the second Odin here with the red um, Hecate and Venus and this will be uh, not via Loki this will be a direct merge uh, into an Odin and that's my next plan while I was doing the first one via Loki uh, this is my uh, second path towards the second um, Odin already read uh, via the, the proper full merge and for that you'll need less emblems but I will need the blast of Sun but as you can see I've managed to gather sufficient amounts and the remainder I can get via magic um, in worst case I can exchange it on the next event cycle and also the next event cycle I'll have the emblems the only thing I don't know is if I can manage to bring Venus to red um, in time because I'll need a lot more advanced Mara than I have um, so an Odin here he the, the one that uh, I got uh, on the first path via Loki um, so merging oranges, uh, orange silks into Loki and then refining Loki into Odin. This one was still requires um, upgrades. So he will need to be upgraded to red. And then uh, in the enchants here we'll need to fill him up with um, advanced sepulchrums. So I will straight away do 3000 which is this event cycle. And I will actually consider to um, to use all the rest because I need him uh, to do time portal and I cannot wait a month. Actually, I'm pretty sure about that. Let's see. We're going to take these. And uh, during that one month, I'll prepare enough resources so that I can 
uh, put the what you call the advanced sepulchrums into other cells. So let's collect these, and I will prepare other cells to sacrifice to get myself more of those advanced sepulchrums. So I think this account, uh, Cosmos, he is now in the condition that he can, um, because the, the uh, event is expiring over here. I'm tired already. Where are you, Mr. Advanced? So if I can't see it straight away, here it is. So uh, it's, it's going to expire in two hours. The next one will be in 28 days. And I cannot um, wait that long for uh, for the Odin. So we're gonna toss in thirty thousand or nine 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 already into him and max him out. And that will be very much needed uh, so that I can um, significantly, hopefully, improve my performance in the time portal. I cannot do the same with the uh, self upgrade. Although here I do see a thousand, so let's do a thousand, and then I'll need an, I'll, I'll need to gather another um, thousand something to, to go uh, to go more. But that's already good enough. Every little bit helps, and every little bit over here we can um, add a little bit more. And now his bell rating is already three hundred thousand. And that was, uh, and that's compared to um, a bit lower bell rating for uh, for Loki, and so he should theoretically do better. And just to check, uh, so that we can, uh, so I can, t I can tell you straight away um, the bell rating. We can come on update. It's not updating. Okay, three sixteen. She has. with the equipment inventory full always inventory managing it's very annoying i wish they gave us 10 extra pages or more all right so now she's to 212000 uh, without uh, equipment so now if I give all that to um, Odin, the last two pieces you have to do manually, there you go. He, he goes, uh, so then he, he has 379 and uh, Loki uh, with the equipment had um, just under 300,000. So this is a significant in, uh, increase in strength and I hope that, that that's gonna um, translate into way better performance in the time portal. Also, um, I'm still used to using my Hecate, that's why I'm, I'm doing this. But um, I should probably be switching already to Odin. Anyways, um, for my daily tasks, I will just go with what I'm used to. Right now I'm just recording and I still have a lot to do. Um, so I don't have time now to uh, to learn <laughs> what a, a new comfort, new level of comfort. Anyway, so um, the next thing is what what's gonna give extra strength is of course via the holy sword, and the fact that and that's a huge, huge, huge um, increase. The fact uh, that you get Odin allows you to completely unlock the holy sword, and that is hugely significant. So we're gonna do that right now. So not only you're getting the, all these stats, so 9,000 health, 3,600 uh, defense, 9,000 health, 3,600 magic defense, another 9,000 health, but more importantly is the Holy Sword gets unlocked. And once the Holy Sword gets unlocked, you can do uh, polishing. And that is what makes the whole difference. So here we can now select the Odin and the Odin can get polished. So we're gonna do that right now. I have the whole reference uh, of polishing on, on the website. You can uh, refer to that if you're interested in any of these numbers. So I'm, that's why I'm clicking fast now. I'm just gonna use up everything I have. There you go. I don't have any more, it needs to 20 for the rest. 
but that that is a significant increase in bell rating so if we check now he's 360 without equipment that is uh, pretty huge so okay let, let's do it so that we can see I'm probably gonna not have backspace again yep that was full lucky alright so with the best set that I have I only have one good set um, which I keep on using so now he is up to almost 500,000 and this is a significant significant um, power up uh, or increase in, in, in strength of the of Cosmos account and, and so um, really a big big milestone right now for for this and so I'm really happy about that it's been a long time of waiting <laughs> or gathering and planning uh, to, to come to this and with that uh, self, I should now be able uh, to. We can switch a room now. Um, with that self, I should be able to do a lot better in time portal, which will allow me to um, earn more of these um, orbs, so that I can polish more. And the more you polish, the more you can perform better, and so forth. So it's it's, it's just gonna cycle um, forward like that. So that's it you guys, in, in terms of chests, um, let's see if I collected I think everything or I will double, che double check it later. But uh, right now I have 847 still uh, chests left and uh, one of the options, that I, the main option I'm considering right now is getting more um, of the resources for the next Odin. So that's it, and uh, if um, the second best option will be uh, to to participate in this lucky exchange, just for the sake of the clothing shards and clothing items, so I can raise my clothing level, uh, which is right now at 98, which is cool. Uh, but I need a lot more initial rage, uh, preferably. I still haven't done any of the um, clothing stones thingy the new thing from patch 7.0 because I'm not sure if they will do an event or not and so um, that's where I am so I hope you guys enjoyed that um, I, I, I congratulate anybody who has done uh, their uh, self upgrade or refinement or merge and if you haven't um, don't uh, worry about it just keep on gathering the resources the cycle with the self upgrade is coming every 28 days if you want to see exact details I've published um, all information on uh, on Dolly Games Fortune if you click on the top menu analysis there is an analysis article on this event cycle which shows you the 28 days cycle and um, easily estimates that the next dates when these events will occur which uh, which can greatly aid you in your planning so that's it you guys um, also um, support by uh, visiting dollygames.com that's my gaming portal where everybody can play games for free and please switch off um, ad block uh, for uh, for dolly games because that's uh, ads are uh, one of the main things which support uh, me paying for all uh, all the bills and everything so um, and of course if any of you can um, can support uh, please sign up on uh, via pa uh, patreon uh, there are already a bunch of players supporting so all that um, helps to cover the costs uh, of running everything and paying for everything um, i'm still in the minus but um, i'm thankful for for any support anybody can show for the, of course if you enjoy the work it makes no sense if you don't but if you're already watching so long and uh, you probably do so that's it you guys thanks for watching and other all the links and so forth will be in the description of the video um, also uh, I'll add cards uh, which you can uh, click to various YouTube playlists um, I also create games myself uh, so all the games that you see by Cosmos are created by me and for those, you can order a customized gift um, made for your family. For and it's for pri it's private password protect. It will be private password protected, and you can literally put your family into the game. Um, I'll do that for you, and it's a wonderful gift uh, to give. 
um, and brings a lot of laughter to the family. So check it out, all the links will be in the description. The gift site is gifts.dollygames.com, uh, the playing games is dollygames.com, the Warchun site is warchun.dollygames.com, and of course check out uh, all the other videos I have on YouTube and the playlist for patch 7.0, uh, 7 the demonstrations of games or, or reviews or, um, or anything else and if um, you have any other thoughts please put it down in the comments and I'll do my best to answer everyone. So that's it you guys, thanks for watching, please do click on like and subscribe if you enjoy my work and um, yeah, have a very nice day.